हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू पार्ट सिक्स ऑफ द डाइंग लाइट टू पी सी वॉक थ्रू सो इन द लास्ट पार्ट वी एक्सप्लोर सम ऑफ द सिटी एरियाज वी अनलॉक द सेफ जोन एट द विंड मिल एंड फाइट सम राइवल गैंग मेंबर्स आई डोंट नो इफ देर राइवल एग्जैक्टली बट वी फॉट सम ह्यूमन्स टू प्रिसाइज एंड ऑल्सो सम जॉम बीज एंड लूटेड सम मिलिट्री वैगन्स वी जस्ट फेल डाउन दे Anyway, so in this part, let's uh, go to an objective rather than just uh, roaming around here and there. Can we? Oh yes, we can. I suppose. Oh my God, my God that was a nasty fall. I thought. Okay, we cannot uh, catch the ledge there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Where are you running away? Come here, Rasul. We never run away from a fight. <laughs> At least not this one. Dodging is very important when fighting multiple zombies. We are not unlock the storm pit, and our kicks are not that much powerful right now. So we have to kill using our weapons only, at least for now. So we have to get inside this uh, whatever this trailer is. Let's open up this military some sort of station. Okay, we have already looted this in the last part. I almost forgot about this. So. Uh, let's um, go to an objective now. Yellow markers are the main objectives, I suppose. So we can't stay in the dark areas for longer than five minutes. Otherwise, we'll be we will turn into infected. We don't want to find those guys. So many fighters inside. I think there must be an ability so that uh, look at this. Uh, there is uh, a small delay between when we press the kick button and we actually kick. I don't like that delay as well. night activity okay so we can only come here at the night in the stores because at day time mushrooms blanch the asparagus fry the onion until translucent of course is there any we don't have any of these so we'll just eat what we got Okay, now it did take down correctly. Okay, virus, get out of here. Oh 
okay we don't have to press any buttons i used to press uh, several buttons during the takedown that's why it was not executed properly i get it now so we don't have to press any buttons if we do press the buttons while he's taking down zombies the takedown will be interrupted okay, let's open up this cupboard not much here but some cans some rats okay uh, there's an unknown location on that side of the building we have to get there somehow because there's a lot of loot there see it's marking up right now there's so many loot inside that Can we get up this? Okay, we can. That's nice. How dare they close the passage to the center? We are free people. Hello guys. We need the juice to turn on the to attack now. Just Can passing through. Wind, Just trying to get inside uh, this apartment. But I don't know how. <laughs> okay, we are directly above the apartment, I think. Yes, I think we are directly above it. Like the rest of them. Hey, I heard Carl talking about water restrictions last night. Know anything about it, Aiden? Okay, this is a night time activity. So I actually thought that we can do it right now. But we can only loot the stores uh, because at the night time all the infected that are inside right now are roaming the streets. So we can come back for these items later. So let's continue on our quest. No zombies around this here area. <laughs> I'm surprised. Okay, found one. Uh, just when I was saying that there are no zombies around, we immediately find one. But he's a loner. Let's leave him alone. Oh oh. If. Now I couldn't name a single one. It's like the virus wiped our memories on top of our vanity. Okay, this is a safe zone. Let's see who we are meeting. Do I know you? is some kind of church. Yes, it's a church. Nice shelter, I must say. Hey, watch where you're going. Sorry. What a day. No freaking way I can do it. Five years of hey, bro. What's the problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Man, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. Okay. What's this test about? I have to design something useful for the citizens. <laughs> I already invented underwater reading glasses for Alberto, then a retractable dog leash, but it kept jamming. 
And besides, we have no dogs here. All my ideas are worthless. Now is my last chance to prove that I am not worthless. Okay. So I spent the last several weeks walking around the bazaar and thinking, thinking hard. And then I hit it. Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad and they give less milk. Mm -hmm. So I came up with the idea of a fence energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. Okay. I called this invention the electric fence. Wow, what a great name. Really a great name. So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I'm missing a few parts. Oh, of course. And they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. <laughs> nah. Something much more interesting. You'll see. I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. As far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Okay. Alberto says they'll be there. Hardware sure. store means we have to go there at but night. It's a dark place, full of turned creatures. Yes. You have to go there at night. <laughs> and the other option? Whatever is left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Mm -hmm. Bandits roam in the area, so it's possible there's nothing left there. In which case, you'll have to look for other patrol remains, or take a night trip to the store. <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just <laughs> fantastic! Heaven must have sent you. Yeah, here. <laughs> I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. Wait till he sees it. Meet me by the goat pen then, near the wall. Right. <laughs> So this is why we have to loot guys <laughs> because we did loot everything so we are actually completing this quest right away so that there you have it the importance of looting everything <laughs> okay what is this missing okay so many of them at all the dead people it says here they're missing same difference they never find them anyway now then why the board it's been 15 years. Many people disappeared back then. My neighbor lost his two kids. But life goes on. Except nobody has the courage to take those photographs down. But it's hopeless. Since there are no night runners, the search always ends the same. Yeah, those night runners. Tell me about them. What's there to say? Nearly all of them are dead. When oh. they were around, they were the only ones not afraid to go out at night. They rescued those who didn't manage to get to a shelter. But of the entire group, only a few survived, including Frank, their former commander. Once upon a time, he was great. Now, he drinks himself into a stupor at his place in the central That's loop. That's sad story. Hard to say how much longer he'll be around. Have you heard of kids who were in the GRE tests? Huh. And who wasn't in the tests? <laughs> the young, the old, the blind, the deaf. Everyone came to find a vaccine. Some for cash. Others to cheat destiny and not get infected but that was the devil's bargain of villador walled in with the plague but given the chance to be the ones who gave the cure to the world well the virus won the study was eventually discontinued and the children officially no one tested on children human rights and other <laughs> crap and unofficially and Unofficially, 
Apparently, some of the kids were taken out of the city. Oh my god. The rest? Well, they just scattered around the city, abandoned. If the infected didn't get them, then hunger or darkness did. Okay. There's a chance to find him here. Yeah. Where are all these kids at now? After all those years, most of them are probably dead. If someone got luckier and is still wandering around, they would probably be in the central loop. More peacekeepers there. Easier to survive. Okay. Someone must know more. Why? The past is the past, and there's no point in dredging it back up. Everyone has their own <laughs> problems. Here and now, Pilgrim. Everyone fights for themselves. That is also true. Everyone fights for themselves. Turn this on. Let's see. Have you milked the goats? Where is the demonstration? I'm not doing that much better. What happened? Man? Everything all right? No, it's grilled. The goat is grilled. Oh my God! That's You're not a goat. Idiot. What happened? I must have overcalculated the voltage. See, he's useless. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could get it so wrong. I told you it would be a waste of time. Why? I don't think so. This is very, very. It has big, huge. You're saying it has potential. Potential, <laughs> yes. It could be an effective weapon. A okay. weapon? It's a ready formula. If you just use it on a weapon, it could raise your odds against turned creatures. The brave goat gave its life <laughs> to science. There's dinner for everyone. And you? I take you as a... Uh, and pronounce you uh, Apprentice. Uh, a... A... Uh, Craftmaster? Really? Oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we'll talk later. Come, Vincenzo. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. If it's not strong enough, come round to my craft master workshop. Sure, thanks. Right. Just uh, watch yourself out there, okay? No worries, friend. But I have got to say, man. Okay, there is shock mod on the weapons now. This is not a goat, or is it a goat? It more looks like a deer. Maybe it's a goat. <laughs> Never mind. Let's go to the skill points. Air kick. Okay. Let's unlock the dodge skill. And uh, let's. Modify this pickaxe. Zap mod. Alright, let's go some go with some people. More people at the bazaar. Suppose there are more people inside. So we have to talk to the main guy. Hey kid, aren't you that pilgrim? Hey, that's nice of you. 
Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? what? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? <laughs> but well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. What? When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! You're lying, Julian? You're fucking toast! Okay, what is going on here? I keep... Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. So, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy <laughs> in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of the Villador, on okay. Hanfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... <laughs> Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. <laughs> we'll come for you if you are not telling us the truth. So let's hey, visit the workshop and trade some Guys, items. Cannot. Okay, we can buy blueprints and upgrade our weapons here. Okay, merchants can be there to sell you weapons directly. Oh my god, so steep prices for such low weapons, low damage weapons. 24 damage for 800 bucks. What? Let's buy some electrical parts. And Some scraps. Sell all valuables. Okay. I almost forgot about those. We have valuables on us. Let's buy this. Hey, that's the pill. Okay, here is our bedding and our stash, so we can rest in this place, that's nice. We have to get to the leader of this place. Uh, let's go uh, look for, let's take a look around the bazaar a little bit, outside.
ओके जर्नल एंट्री Let's look at our journal. One more time. Okay, there's a level two chest. Quest. Spend time at the bazaar while waiting to hear from Hakon. Okay. Very funny. <laughs> Very funny. Let me tell you something. If I were you, then I'd have wished for them to end me. Oh. Would you rather have needless deaths on your conscience? I wish you didn't hang the innocent here. Well, it all worked out, didn't it, <laughs> Pilgrim? You didn't kill anyone, and you're free. Win-win. Who is Barney? Everyone knows Barney here. I don't. Tell me. Well, wouldn't bother yourself about Barney. He doesn't like nosy people. Liable to piss him off if he finds out. Hey, you don't want that kind of trouble. Well, now I definitely want to know more. <laughs> okay. He's Sophie's younger brother. Some say he's crazy, but he's a pillar of the bazaar. The PKs are afraid of him, and they should be. Barney is no one to fuck with. All right. Yes, that's me. That's nice. <laughs> you look familiar. Yeah, I'm the guy who almost got hanged. Why worry? You're standing here, aren't you? Excuse me. Look, we had no choice. If you had turned like we thought you were gonna, it would have been a massacre. A crowd of people against one infected. <laughs> Odds were in your favor. Huh. I see you already got a marker. More time you spend here, more you'll understand. Our rules are strict, but that's how we survive. Fair enough. Sure. Ah, oh, gee. I gotta remember to buy wax. We're almost out of candles. <laughs> Do I know you? Can't talk to hey, him. Can't talk to her. Can we talk to him? No. So okay. Hey, UV bar. Okay. Blows up the competition. No. Okay, I think we have talked to everybody <laughs> now. Not the one who killed him, I bet. I met Lucas several times, and for a PK, he seemed accessible to me. Maybe that was his problem. Not go shouting in the middle of the bazaar. They surprised me. How was I supposed to know they had shears? Why not? Can you hear yourself at all? Who else wants to talk to us? <laughs> Okay, I think we have talked to almost everybody here, <laughs> but we are not getting uh, a cutscene. Let's um, wait until night. Let's see if that helps. Anyway. Wait until morning again. <laughs> All right. Sometimes I wake up at night and forget the fall even happened. It's about the only time I smile. Then I see the goddamn. All right, guys. So let's stop here for this part. Hope you enjoyed the video.
make sure to like and subscribe to my channel also share the video with your friends i'll see you guys in the next part peace